Example 11, factoring a trinomial in the form of ax to the power of 4 plus bx squared plus c. Oh, snaps. All right, so uh, here's the trick of factoring these kind of guys. Um, I'm going to rewrite this and in a way that hopefully would uh, make a little more sense here. I'm going to rewrite this as 6. Um, r squared, and I'm going to put this in parentheses squared, meaning if I were to multiply r squared times or raise that to the power of 2, you just multiply this so I get back that, minus 13 r, and I'm going to put squared, I'm, I'm doing this purposely, plus 5. And what I want you to notice is this, is 6 r squared minus 13 r plus 5. So I ignore the squares. So if you ignore the squares, then 6r squared minus 13r plus 5 is what we're used to. We're used to having it in, um, in that form. So the reason why I'm showing that to you is, um, is that we can actually replace, or we can say, you know what, let's let let's let r, actually, hold on quick, let me just put this over here. Let's let um, r squared equal to some variable that maybe like we'll just say um, we'll just say u again like we did last example so if we let r squared equal u well that means then that this now would become 6 u squared right minus 13 really this is supposed to be r squared so minus 13 u and then plus 5 okay so again we haven't changed the problem all I do is I'm just I'm letting u equal r squared, but it's still the same problem. So again, just like last example, let's factor this, and then once you're done factoring that, then you just replace all of the u's with r squared. So let's go ahead and just straight go into, into the answer. I'm going to do my guess and check method. If I, if I want to get 6u squared, I'm going to use 3u and 2u, and I'm going to use uh, 5, so I'm going to use um, 1 and 5. So let's just check this. 1 times u is 2u. 3u times uh, 5 is 15u. Can I get negative 13 out of 2u and 15u? Well, yeah, right? I want the 2u to be positive, and I want the 15u to be negative. So that would be the answer of that. Okay, so the factor form of this is a th uh, 3u plus 1 times 2u minus 5. Uh, but now we, we want to replace all the u's with um, r squared. So now this is actually 3 times r squared plus 1. And then uh, 2 r squared minus 5. And um, it looks like that's it then. And that would be the answer. Let's take a look at uh, this guy over here now. I'm going to do the same thing. Um, I'm going to let I'm going to let uh, r squared be equal. Actually, we're going to be doing um, x squared now, right? We're going to be doing x squared. So, so, so we're going to let um, x squared be equal to u. So now this becomes six x squared. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, six u squared. Six u squared plus eleven u plus three. All right, so if I uh, factor that guy and see if I want six u, I'm just going to use three u and two u and um, one and three. So one times u is two u, and three u times that is a nine u, and nine plus two is eleven u. So I'll make these both uh, plus signs. So that's the answer right there. And uh, lastly, let's replace all the uh, the u's. So three, I'm going to replace that with x squared plus one, and uh, two x squared plus three, and that's it.